Hello my brothers and sisters and welcome back to another Reaction Packed episode of Chris the Butcher on Friends. Right, I've been in Asda and uh, I picked up an egg cooker. It was 10 quid, it's there. So let's give it one of these. Ladies and gentlemen, I give to you Chris the Butcher's Super Cool Review. There it is. Now I've seen uh, so the, some of these egg cookers on Amazon, something like made from 13 to 30 quid. Uh, and I was just in Asda getting a bit of shopping. And there it was George Home egg cooker, 10 quid. Bang on the nose, not 9 99 not £10 and a penny. Bang on a cocking then. Uh, and it just says egg cooker cooks one to six eggs, soft, medium, on, or hard boiled. And it's got an omelette tray included. Now, I'm not going to delve into the omelette tray today because I can't be bothered. But we're going to see if it does hard boiled eggs. And I, really, I do really want a soft boiled egg so you get the, the runny yolk. Uh, Connor's on do it eating healthy. So I'm going to cook six hard boiled. Don't worry, I'm going to try one on camera. Kick Connor, it'll probably demolish the lot in one sitting. And I'm going to do, probably, I'll probably do, do six soft boiled as well. Why not? Uh, he can have a sausage, but he can have an egg butty can. So, yeah, basically 10 quid. Uh, measuring cup with egg piercer included. Why do, why do I need egg piercer? Right, anyway, we'll look into that. We'll get it out, get the instructions out. Have a shufties. Right now. Before we open the box, these are the eggs I'm using. Uh, as there's free range, there's 12 medium eggs there. British class A. Don't really want to be doing really crap eggs, do we? Uh, I really should have thought about this before I did it. To get in the box, you know. Obviously, the sellotape's still on it, so we know it's sealed. Right. You can't really see me off camera, but yeah, we're off. back on camera now. There's the plug, obviously. Get that out. Instructions, yes. Da, 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 da. Bag we don't need. Oh, the lid's come off. Take that off. That can go back on there. I'll just stick that on there. Uh, that's the innards for our eggs to sit on, I presume. No, that's your omelette tray. And then we've got our jug with an egg piercer in it, apparently. Uh, yeah. An egg pierce, a bit of plastic in the bottom of there. That has got. Is it? Egg piercer there? What? Yeah? I have no idea what's going on with that. <laughs> I've got to be honest. That's what your egg sits on. That is your egg timer. You Obviously, you put water in there as well. And then you put that. I've got stuck, stuck to me. That on there, is it? That there, like that. Yeah, that there on that. Put your eggs in there, water in it, that on top. Switch it on. Bob's your uncle fan as you run. Right, I'm going to put that down there. And uh, I'm going to have a quick shufties of the instructions and see where we're up to. Right, I've given everything a wipe down. We're not using the omelette thing. That's the lid. We need that. Uh, and on there, I don't know if you'll be able to see it. That's how much water you're putting. You want it hard, you want it medium, you want it soft. So we're going to go for hard boiled eggs. Why it says custard on there, I ain't got a clue. So we're going to fill that up to the hard... Yard setting. Are we on there? Oh, a bit more. Right, that is how many you need for six hard boiled eggs. Bang. Let's get our eggs in now. One, two, three, four, five. Six, is, there's one in the middle, it'll do seven actually, so let's stick seven in. Yes, look at that. If you think it's off-centre, off, off center, by the way, it's because the lead's not long enough to get it. <laughs> That's as far as it goes. Right, lid on. And I believe, right, there it is, it's switched on. I believe once it's done and it's ready, the light goes off. Air presto, we'll have seven boiled eggs, hard boiled eggs. And when we've done them, we'll try it the soft version. I just wanted to show you, we're about three minutes in. And it's definitely doing something, isn't it? So, uh, yeah, hopefully we'll keep this camera angle. 
for when we uh, release the lid and it switches off. The eggs are still going to be there, aren't they? But, you know, <laughs> don't know what to expect. Lift it off and they've hatched. I doubt it, do you? Hey, you never know. Right, anyway, yeah, we'll be back when they're done. Right, the machine doesn't turn off. It makes a click. Now, it's just made the click. And that means the water is boiled dry. Well, if you can see in there, there's now no water in there. So what I'm going to do is turn that off. Switch it off at the mains. Get that off. And get them in some cold water. And then uh, we'll crack one. Get up here and uh, see how hard boiled it is. They look a bit... <laughs> yeah. I think they're... <clears throat> they're not. Definitely, definitely done. Right, I'll get these in cold water quick. There is my egg. Uh, I've got six more of them. They're still in the cool water. They'll do for Connor and Josh when they want a snack. Uh, but yeah, 15 minutes it took in the egg cooker down there. Uh, and I was a little bit disappointed that right away off the bat, before we even bite into this egg, that it didn't cool down. Uh, it didn't switch off when it was finished. Essentially, if you don't watch it, it just keeps on burning and burning and burning. To the point, it, your eggs are going to explode. It could cause a mess. It will just burn it out. And the first time you use it, it might just break it or even cause a fire. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, there's a lot. There's egg cookers out there that actually switch off boom, and stop doing what they're doing after a certain period of time. That doesn't. It just keeps going. It was a tenner, which let's be honest, it is just an egg cooker. But if you, if you, you know what I mean, you can't take your eye off it. <laughs> so that's my first criticism right now. The uh, uh, George Holm. Egg cooker, but it cost me 10 quid. You have to watch it. So you might as well just cook them on the fucking hob, haven't you? Right, anyway. Boiled egg. Down with gizzard. Boiled apple sleeve. Definitely are boiled. Nothing wrong with that. It's a boiled egg. And it peeled really easy, so... Mmm. What's to not like about a boiled egg? Lou. <laughs> she hates boiled eggs. She hates eggs. Any eggs. Any eggs. Any description of egg. She hates it. But I like it. Now I said I'm going to do some soft boiled eggs. But as usual, that took longer than I expected. I've run out of time. I've got to actually go out now. So uh, I can't actually do any more with it. But so what we'll do is we'll call that the egg cooker hard boiled egg part one. I'll do that in the next. In a, I'll probably do it again in a couple of weeks when I get a chance. I've got other things I want to do yet, yeah. uh, and we'll do the soft boiled ones. But uh, for this video, that is it. It was all right. I like the egg. The egg cooker doesn't. I don't like the egg cooker for the fact that it just doesn't switch off. It just carries on and carries on and carries on. So you've got to be eagle-eyed and watch it and wait for that click. And if you don't hear the click because you're out of room, you come back, you have to keep taking the lid off to make sure the water's, there's still water in there. If the water's gone, there's no water. It's done. And then you switch it off quick. Right, anyway, yeah. That's all I can say about it. I fucking love you. <laughs>